How's it going guys? Welcome back to another AJ Auto Review. Today the car that we are going to be checking out is the 2016 BMW X5. So guys check out the exterior. The 2015-2016 uh, exterior does not have a significant change. So these are the headlights. Some the BMW adaptive LEDs. You have parking sensors at the front. A very common BMW grill, which you know you have your fog light here. You have 19 inch front and back wheels. As you can see, this is the sport version. As you can see the M badging here. 3500 3.5 liter diesel drive. I'm going to be showing you the engine later. Coming into the back, the usual BMW back. You can tell it's a diesel because the advertiser always can say BMW clean diesel. You have dual exhaust. And I guess that's all you need to see in the in the exterior. So guys, check out. Let's check out the interior. So guys, this is a very very lovely interior. You have it's all it's an all black interior except for this aluminium strip here. You can see this black, some lovely chrome. You can see very huge, very huge leather, comfortable leather seats. They're very fluffy. This this seats you can sit here for the rest of your life and you won't have back. Um so this is the BMW steering wheel as you can see more M badging here. More M badging. Uh you have your typical you have your typical steering controls, lane uh lane keep assist, cruise control, uh cruise control, this one to control your volume on your infotainment. Uh, on the door, you have your typical door, window power window controls, your side mirror controls down there. You have a button to open up your boot. Uh, this is your driver's dash. Let me turn it on, as you can see. That's your driver's display dashboard. This is your infotainment screen, it's very huge. Under that, you have big, very big, huge events. Down there, you have your climate controls. Down there, you have the controls for your radio. Um, you can choose to hide your cup holders, or you can open them up like that. Here you have your, your cigarette lighter. Uh, this is your gear shifter. Uh, it's a typical BMW gear shifter. This uh, you have uh, plenty of buttons here. You can. This is your traction controls. Uh, you can choose either sport mode or comfort mode. These are your parking sensors. This is your 360 degree camera. Your hill descent, hill descent assist on this side. This one is to control your infotainment. This is to control your infotainment, which is very nice. Um, this is your center glove box. It has a USB and auxiliary in port, which is this top is also covered in leather and it's soft leather um on the passenger side you have a very tiny glove box <sighs> the seats are leather you don't have heated seats here or cooled you also don't have a cooled or a heated steering wheel you have paddle shifters because this car is manual and and automatic so this is how you shift with the paddle shifters when they're nice they're in this chrome aluminium and plastic they feel 
high quality yeah and i guess that's all you need to see in the front interior of the of the bmw x5 on top here you have a sunroof and a moonroof let me close it so you can see how black this interior is which is very lovely this car has no tint but you feel like it is tinted it's very dark inside which is very nice yeah guys so let's go and check out the back seats then i show you the boot then i show you the bonnet yeah guys so this is the interior back of the x5 you can see sufficient leg room i'm not going to hit anything you don't have a, so, uh, a bump here so sitting in the middle row, it's middle seat no problem um uh correction i said does not have heated seats but it has cool seats sorry i didn't mention that correctly the heats are not ventilated though so it takes time for the cooling to take place as you can see you also have cool seats at the back also the front but you don't have heated ones though uh but leather is usually very good if you've entered a leather car leather interior cars the seats are very cold or when they are hot they are very hot so maybe they considered when it's very hot outside and the heat enters the car you can cool your seats down um you have some shelves here to put your phones you have a cigarette uh, outlet here cigarette a uh, lighter outlet i almost touched it the hot um if no one is sitting in the middle row, middle seat, you can pull this one down. Get two cup holders here. It also has true loading, so you can, if you have long items, you can put them here. Yeah. Through loading. Yeah, and guess I guess that's all you need to see in the back of the BMW X5. So guys, checking out the boot of the X5. It's an electric boot, opens two way, double hinged, up and down. You can see it's a very very huge boot. There's nothing you can't fit inside here. You also have plastic mats, so you have both uh, foam and uh, both these ones plastic uh, mats. You have more storage, very very a lot, a lot of storage down there. You also have more storage here. So there is no problem fitting anything you want inside this boot because it's double hinged up and down and there is no bump when you are offloading anything you see it's flat so guys let's go and check out the bonnet this is where you unlatch your bonnet there is no sticker so you just have to use your brain but I've already shown you the BMW X5 as you can see twin power turbo this has a twin turbo 3.5 liter 8 speed dual clutch automatic gearbox which puts out 350 horsepower yeah guys and I guess that's all you need to see in the morning I can't talk it's an it's an L L L L six L six. It's an L six type engine. As you can see, quality inspection. Yeah, this car is just beautiful. If I had the money, this is the car I'll be buying right now. Um. So guys, that's all you need to know about the BMW X five twenty sixteen. It has very cool features that we couldn't show everything in this video but if you want to check out the car yourself i'll be leaving my number down below uh make sure you subscribe like and tell us the cars you want to you want us to do next um we have a lot of lots and lots and lots of deals great deals for you if you if you want to buy a car um yeah and i'll see you guys in the next video make sure you comment like you guys do not comment in our video so make sure you comment in this one and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.